How are you faring? Oh, so you've got a camera, it seems. I warrant you got it from Igashichi. Am I right? The thing is, I've got more work than I can handle. So many people want pictures taken. And that's where I was hoping you could help. Would you mind taking some photographs for me? You will be rewarded. Don't worry about that. Did you manage to take the pictures I asked you to? I look forward to seeing how you fare. Have you been... Now, I wonder if you've ever chanced upon any foreign books. As our nation has opened up, there are more and more of them in circulation. It seems there are many tomes about Western technology and weaponry. I'd love to find them. But I'm far too busy inventing. I know! Why don't you search for books for me? Come on, what do you say? They'll no doubt help me improve my tinkering skills. Let's see what he can do. What would you like me to work on? 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 You have a moment. I have a little problem that needs solving. Mind if I pick your brains a little? I wasn't expecting you to be so mercenary. We are friends, aren't we? Just to hear me out. So, some officials barged in the other day, demanding that I invent some mechanisms that could be utilized for combat. Of course, I do have some experience in designing tools for clients, but only for those I trust, and these men I did not. As you'd expect, I refused. So they demanded I hand over some of my inventions, lest I be dragged off and beheaded. 
which is when it came to me, the perfect scheme to get one over on them. However, the plan requires some assistance. Please, can I count on you? Truly, I owe you one. I know this is sudden, but can you come to my hidden storehouse with me? I've left some tools there. Come on! All right, let's be off! Hold it, Iska. Where do you think you're going? Oh, um, just going to pick up some materials. <laughs> you are not fooling anyone, pal. How about I help you concentrate on your work? Of course, they're barely a threat to you. But do it quickly, please. So do you could wizard your way out of his bodyguard? I put you down here and now! I really appreciate you agreeing to help. This way! Follow me. The Shogunate obviously wants an advantage over its enemies. But I'd thank them not to drag me into their bloody mess. Keep my inventions at my secret storehouse. <laughs> inventions, I say, but it's mostly useless junk. Come on now! They've served to fool that official for a while, passed off as works in progress. But he's starting to suspect. If this plan doesn't work, well, I think up another one. But with you coming along, I'm sure all will be well. Cute's hmm? gonna far now. Unfortunately, I've got something handy on me. Come on, over here. Why don't you try using this? I made it using a Western clockwork mechanism. It takes in sounds from the surroundings and expresses them visually. It's only a prototype, but you should be able to make good use of it. It's all yours, provided this experiment goes to plan. If we don't make it to the storehouse, my scheme will be up in smoke. Well, it should allow you to detect foes in hiding or even through solid walls. I'll hide here until it's over. Use my new device well, and you're bound to have the upper hand!
This is where the bastard keeps his toys. to the storehouse. All right, let's go with this. It ought to look the part to them. I can't thank you enough for your help, and certainly not with this junk. But if you see anything you like, it's all yours. Ah, you want to use the fire pipe? It's a little dangerous, but all right, let's step outside and try it. Looks like you've frightened off the rest of them. I'll leave the fire pipe to you, along with the figuring out how to use it. Now we have all the tools we need. The next step is to contact Yukichi Fukuzawa to help as well, and go over the plan with him. Fukuzawa's knowledge is vital. He doubles in Western medicine and is an expert on chemicals as well. Right. Let's split up for now. I'll get Fukuzawa up to speed in the meantime, but let's meet again soon. Welcome!
Is there anyone with confidence in their martial skills? That is a very fine steed you have there. Pray, would you like to try some horseback archery? Horseback archery is the ancient art of shooting arrows at a target while riding atop a horse. Although some will tell you it is incredibly old-fashioned, I believe it to be an indispensable tool for refining one's etiquette. I do hope you will devote the time to mastering this important art. My name is Kiyokane Ogasawara. As the name would suggest, I instruct others in the Ogasawara style of archery. I believe the art of horseback archery is an excellent teacher of the true samurai spirit. As such, I make it a point to occasionally recruit new students from those I meet. Then let me be your guide. Please, this way. Thought I'd drop by. Not working too hard, I hope. I'm listening. Really? Look up. What do you need? <laughs> See you later. Ugh. <sighs> 
Hey, how about a game? What would you like to do? How many do you want? Have fun, and good luck. Folks, come, press your bets. You finished? Then betting is closed. The numbers are four and one on. Haha, <laughs> I won. Next game. Folks, come, press your bets. You finished? Four and six even. Yeah! Had no trouble getting here, I trust. Katsu is a very prominent figure. He's likely to be in one of the boats in the middle. Once the fireworks start, you'll need to find him without anyone seeing you. You could navigate the boat's roofs, or you could swim there. I'll leave it to you and Sakamoto to do the deed. I'll stay here and keep the Shogun's men away. So. Are you all set to kill Katsu? The fireworks are about to begin. Hold on until then. So shall we get started or what? I'm ready for action. Well, a spectacular sight. We can bring some help.
Rather sudden. Why don't we settle this huh? with our fists? Hey! Watch out! Gah! 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 Gah
quite effective. Someone should collect all the army's gunpowder. Then we could really have a firework display. The rebels went too far, but they're right to want war. The Shogun, they killed Master Shogun! So you're going to overthrow the Shogun? Fine. Then what? Surely you don't think you can sink the black ship with that sword. If you've got a better idea, I'm all ears. Well, got something? I do, actually. I plan to build Japan a navy. With black ships of our own, foreigners will think twice before sailing into our waters. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> As for the Shogunate, you're not wrong. It's a lame duck. Seen from the inside, that's clear as day. But have you considered it'd be quicker to fix it than to spend all your time overthrowing it? So how about it? Do you two want to help me out? Murder, arson. Is that what Shoin wanted? The letters arrived from Katsu himself. It seems he wants our help with something. <sighs> Ever since that night, I've been itching to take action. I want to help change our nation. But there has to be a better way. I had a feeling you'd see things my way. I just... I can't go along with Gensui's methods anymore. Katsu's working out his own vision for what this country could be. You remember what he said on the boat, don't you? I think it's fate things ended up this way, even if I do still feel a little adrift. My gut says to see how far we can go together with Katsu. This isn't the end of the road with Gensui, though. We'll work with Katsu for now. 
but we're not abandoning Genzui and the others. We should make our way to Katsu's place in Akasaka. You'll be waiting for us there. Ah, it's you. So, you made it. Now before we go any further, let me make clear that I have no wish to fight you. Don't worry. We've decided to take you at your word. In that case, let us begin. Now, to revive the Shogunate, we must learn from the West, but also call on our nation's strengths. But we need recruits, be it in the army, medicine, or the martial arts. And that's where you come in. I'm grateful, but the two of you alone will not suffice. We need large numbers of able swordsmen for an imminent operation. Ryoma. You practice Hokushin Itoryu, I believe. You know Hachiro Kiyokawa, I trust? Yes, we've trained together countless times. I've learned a lot from him. I want you to ask him to help the Shogunate. It seems he is in the Chiba Dojo. I sense this request is best coming from you. Of course. I didn't expect you to render your services for free. Who are you looking for? I see. It'll take some time, but I'll see what I can turn up. I'm sure I can find at least a few clues while you tackle the work I set you. Quid pro quo, as they say in the West. I'm counting on you to get us the help we need. While we must be prepared to stand up to the West, we cannot ignore the needs of our people. That will only aid our foes. Above all, it is cholera which demands our attention. There is an expert in Western medicine working on a cure right now in Kanda. I want to make sure that remains their sole focus. Would you go talk to them? See what you can do. I see you are no fool. In fact, a French military officer is currently here at our invitation, training our forces in the Western style. The esteemed Admiral Enomoto is grappling with this as we speak, but all is not going to plan. Go to the Hanzamon Gate and lend him a hand. Very well. Please. Do not let me down. Now I'm afraid I have other business to attend to. Come and see me once you have done what I asked of you. Do you mind if I leave the military stuff to you? That kind of thing's not really my forte. Thanks. Don't worry, I won't make you take care of everything. I'll do what I can to help. Ah, it's you. Oh, you rounded off any fugitives?
Interested in anything else? Best of luck out there. Ah, it's you. Ah, perfect timing. Katsu says dinner is on him. He wants to thank us for all the work we've done. And to be honest, I still have a lot of questions for him. Well, care to join us? Excellent. Let's be on our way then. Ah, you're here. So, where are we off to, Katsu? I'm looking forward to this. I'm afraid my invitation was merely a pretext to ask another favor of you. Mind if we discuss the matter over our meal? Thanks. You can be sure I'll pay you back for this. Everyone good with my usual haunt? Busy as we've been, I haven't eaten there in a while. At long last, the Shogunate fleet's taking shape. Even the crew's beginning to look the part. The hardest part's yet to come, though. And I'll be counting on your help in the days ahead. There's no shortage of those who say the Shogunate can't be trusted. Hence all these divine punishments. Have you heard? People are taking it upon themselves to punish those who deal with foreigners. <laughs> Damn fools. They ought to try sinking the black ships that started it all. Yoma. What are... What are you doing here? Izo? Huh? I didn't realize you were on duty today. Hmm? By your confusion, I'll take it you're out of the loop. On Ryoma's recommendation, I've hired Izo as my bodyguard. Speaking of which, where the hell have you been? Well, now that you're here, you can come along for a meal with us. Well, what do you think, Izo? Katsu has real vision, doesn't he? Bet he taught you a thing or two. Ah, uh, indeed. He's a great man. You know, he didn't come from money. I had no pedigree. But you'd be hard pressed to find anyone with a mind as shrewd or judgment as keen. And yet he treats everyone as his equal. Even the lowly people like me. I can't help but feel that if he were to take the reins, the Shogunate would regain his former glory. What? Have you lost your mind? Ryoma, <laughs> you must be hurt. Katsu <sighs> must die, and we must use it right now. <laughs> you to get me, I'll kill you too. The only way to save our country is to bring down the Shogunate. What am I doing?
You've taken Master Showing's legacy and trampled all over it. You'd better pray we don't meet again. Showing it, dogs. There he goes. Ryoma, for better or worse, Izo sees things in black and white. He's beyond my help. He's convinced that because some officials are responsible for the people's suffering, simply killing the right men in power will fix everything. So, nothing's changed since we were in Yokohama. I had a feeling Izo was going to turn on me before long. I had thought Ryoma was the only one who could reach him. I didn't think I had much of a choice. I mean, I'm not planning on dying just yet. Sorry, let's do dinner another day. And I really am going to make this up to you. Izo's got Master Showin's teachings all wrong. I thought maybe if he talked to Katsu, he'd quickly realize his mistake. Talking to you always makes me feel better. But I just can't look the other way. It's clear we have to do something about Izo. Far too much blood will be spilled if we leave him be. I'll be happy to give you a generous discount. It's you. Ah, there you are. I used to come here all the time, you know. But the last time I came, 
things didn't quite go as planned. Ah, sorry, uh, I just can't bring myself to tell you. What I'm saying is I can't face going in there today. Why don't we take care of something else first? I'm sorry. I'll sort this out. I really will. What I'm saying is, I can't face go. Ah, all right, all right. Anything to help forge a new Japan. We'll probably find Hachiro at the dojo around this time of day. Been a while, Ryoma. True. It's good to see you again. I've come to ask a favor, actually. In order to change this country of ours, I'm trying to work out how to reform the Shogunate. And I need the help of skilled swordsmen like you to do it. Hmm. Reform the Shogunate, eh? That's certainly a lot to chew on. Give me some time to consider it, will you? Incidentally, the demon bell of Chiba wants to see you. Don't keep her waiting. Huh? Huh? Oh, Ryoma! Oh! I had hoped no, to no, see you. No, 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 no. Oh. You finally come back to propose, oh. haven't you? I wanted to see you too, Lady Zana, but uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just too busy to be thinking about things like that right now. Oh? Are you trying to <laughs> weasel out of your promise? Well, if you're intent on denying me that... <laughs> then fight me instead! <sighs> Okay, okay, but you know how I've never been able to stop myself from going easy on you. Oh. Well, my friend here is just as strong as me. Why don't you fight them instead? <sighs> fight them, you say? my doubts, but if it will finally make you deliver on your promise. I consent. I warn you, I won't lose. Ryoma will be mine. Well, I'd love to stay and watch, but I think you need some privacy. Sanachiba, niece of Shisaku, on your guard. Such impeccable technique. Giving up? Far from it. You can't win this. If you think I'm still a little girl, you're quite mistaken. I'm not 
done yet. Enough, ladies, Anna. Please, give up. Okay, thanks. You really helped me out. That was some fine work. If you're looking for your mind, Lady Sana, they ran off somewhere. But I'd leave them be for now. Besides, you said something about wanting my help to reform the Shogunate, right? Very well. Beat me, and I'll lend a hand. Please, don't hold back. Give me everything you've got. Samurai are men of their word. I lend you my aid. You know, you're too polite to be a friend of Ryoma's. Hachiro, what's going on? Looks like Sana and Ryoma took off somewhere. Ah, uh, Master! Sorry for disturbing you. I was just sparring with this uh, visitor. I've not seen you before. May I ask why you're here? 
Oh, dear me. It's time Ryoma reaped what he sowed. He's in for it now. This is Ryoma's friend. Said they're going round looking for skilled swordsmen to try and reform the Shogunate. And they're dead serious about it, too. Hell, they even strung out me into helping them out. Damn. To think a master like Hachiro could lose. But if you're after good fighters, why not head to the Odani Dojo? Master Odani must be known by just about every swordsman in Edo. He's bound to be a great help. Do come back here whenever you like, though. As a friend of Ryoma, there's no need to be shy. Hey! Are you faring well? I am over the moon. If you'd like me to instruct you, then very well. Let neither of us hold back. You got me. As I hoped, you've a firm handle on your techniques. You there. 
Have a minute? I'm sorry for bothering you, but I have a favor to ask. Won't you hear me out? I'm an instructor at another dojo, you see. And the other day, I saw one of my students cut down a stranger on the street. I confronted him and tried to mete out his punishment, but I couldn't bring myself to finish it, and he escaped. If I face my student again, I fear I'll hesitate again. I can't trust myself to stop him. Please, won't you do it in my stead? Thank you. My student has gotten a taste for blood and will keep on killing. We have no choice but to put him to death. Kill me! My master asked you to come, didn't he? If only you'd seen how he laughed as he killed other senior disciples. He must know that I saw him. And now he intends to kill me too. But I cannot die until I have avenged my brothers! Ah, oh, you're back! Safe and sound! You've done it then. Tended to my student. What are you talking about? Did you deal with my student or didn't you? So you did! So you did! Do you have proof of the deed? By any chance? It would set my mind at ease if there was something I could see. You've heard everything from him, it seems. Why? 
Oh, why couldn't you just do the deed? Fine. I'll just kill him myself. It's more enjoyable that way, and I'll become stronger for it. But first things first, I'll amuse myself by killing you. You know too much. <laughs> your hand.
Who are you? Why are you here? I wouldn't go that far. But I do indeed practice Western medicine. I see we share the same goal. But unfortunately, now is not the time. Hmm. Is that right? I see. <sighs> Simply chatting won't help matters. But since there's nobody else I can ask, I might as well share. Ine Kusumoto. I studied Western medicine, and I'm researching a cure for cholera here. Those suffering with the disease cannot be ignored. But I am yet to see much in the way of success. I've been trying to make medicine. But it all turned out to be poison. And a deadly one to boot. It needs to be properly sealed in a container, or poison gas will escape. The anti-shogunate folks heard about it somewhere, and came to ask me how to make it. They're up to no good, I'm certain. And they've been haranguing me in my lab ever since. All of my colleagues were terrified and ran off. They sent me a threat this morning. They're planning an attack. But I can't just turn my back and flee. I have to protect my lab. Truly? Okay, please. That's... Wonderful news. They're planning to strike when the sun sets. Are you ready? The gates are blockaded, so it will take time for them to get in, which means they'll likely approach from the rear. I'm counting on you. But please, take care of yourself. Here. Whatever it takes, we can't let them destroy the lab. There are jars of poison in the garden. Try throwing them at the intruders. I say, Lord God, have no cheek.
smooth.
That's enough for today, I think. I'll be going. <sighs> Thank you so much. I am truly grateful to you. Now I can finally go back to studying cures for cholera. Could I ask another favor? Would you be so kind as to track down Dr. Narasaki? He was rounded up during the recent purge, and he's still in custody. I heard he had just come up with a concoction that eased the symptoms of cholera. I have my work cut out rebuilding this medical facility. In the meantime, I would very much like you to speak to him for me. Please do this for me. And if ever you need anything, you know where to find me. Just received word from the commissioner's office. But they said my father was about to be released. There must be some kind of mistake. You have to double check. Even if there has been a mistake, it's too late. His execution will be carried out as planned. Now, if I've made myself understood, off with you. <sighs> Oh, didn't expect to see you here. Katsu wanted me to meet Shosaku Narasaki. He's the doctor who supposedly figured out how to cure cholera. But it sounds like they're about to take off his head. Katsu never said a thing about that. It's all very strange. That was the doctor's daughter just now. Better go see what's going on. That girl there, does she mean to climb the wall? Hey, what are you thinking? I'm thinking to break my father out of there. Whoa, slow down. Let's not do anything reckless. We will find a way to help your father, okay? You know what we have to do, right? We're going to sneak in. Good thing you came. Couldn't pull this off without you. I've given it some thought. Why don't we kick up a fuss around here and get ourselves arrested? It'll get us inside, which is a start, at least. Pretty ingenious, wouldn't you say? Okay, let's do it. Just focus on getting locked up as soon as possible. You ready? No time like the present. All right, let's go back to that guard. If we cause a scene right in front of him, there's no way he'll miss the chance to lock us up. You again. Huh? Mm -hmm. What do you want? Alright. If 
that doesn't do it, nothing will. All according to plan so far. Now we just need to get out. Out of here. Not a bad deal, right? That the mulish doctor? Uh, I know he got taken to the inner grounds, but that's all I can tell you. We're square now, aren't we? Go on, uh, off you go then. I'm ready for action! Looking so good.
Someone there. Hey, what do you think you're doing? To be executed? Uh, make this quick. Looking so good. Bravo. So you're Dr. Narasaki, are you? Just sit tight for a second. You find the key? <laughs> that woman is quite something. This is madness, Odeo. What were you thinking? But I owe you my thanks. Now, what do you want? I'm sure you didn't rescue me out of purely goodwill. They locked me up, and now they want my help. <sighs> well, whatever it takes to ease people's suffering. Cholera treatment. You must mean the medical school in Kanda. There will be an uproar if I don't show up soon. I'll be off. Wait, are we all right? I'm Ryoma Sakamoto. We're both Ryos. This must be a sign. Can I see you again? A sign, you say? Hmm, maybe I'll give you a chance.
Dr. Narasaki arrived earlier. It seems you rescued him. I thank you. I appreciate all the effort you have gone to. I really must think of a way to repay you. Of course. I'm expecting my colleagues to return shortly. Combining our efforts, I'm confident we'll find a way. I heard something very important from Dr. Narasaki. The juice of the lemon can be used to treat cholera. The problem is, there isn't any of this fruit in Japan. But my father's friend, Mr. Fortune, might be able to help. I'll head now to the Koishikawa Botanical Garden to find him. Meet me there, if you're interested in helping. Who are you? Yes, that's right. Ah, so you're his new assistant, are you? He's told me you're one to watch. <laughs> My name is Takiyaki Enomoto, Admiral of the Shogun's Navy. I've come here today to observe. A company of guards has been soundly beaten by the French in a military exercise. I fear their commanders all but given up on our nation. Without Brunet, our forces stand no chance of being trained to a Western standard. That's why I need you to go out there and impress him. Is that a fact? Either way, I am most grateful. Now, let me show you inside. French forces await beyond. I leave it in your hands. Yeah. 
Here they come! Thought so.
Something? Listen, whatever you intend this time, it will be like before. I still have much to learn. Not bad. When Katsu told me he had arranged some entertainment, he must have meant you. You... you have a curious sense of humor, you know? I am sorry. At Katsu's request, I did not inform the French side that this was barely a continuation of the training exercise. I intended to halt proceedings if things got out of hand. I never imagined a French base would fall. Well, well. It seems I was too hasty in writing this nation off. <laughs> I do not need pressure from you. Admiral Enomoto, I will train your men in French military technique. But there are conditions. I do not expect everyone to be of this warrior's caliber, but I need men who are willing to learn. 
Samurai who rush headlong into battle are mere cannon fodder. I care nothing for status. <laughs> I just need spirited young folks who I can teach to fight from scratch. Understood. We will start to recruit them without delay. I am grateful to you. I'm afraid I must remain here. May I ask one last thing of you? Find Tatsugoro Shinmon in Asakusa and tell him what we've discussed. I'd like him to help recruit some youngsters. Chief of the Firefighters. He's an old acquaintance of Katsu's, and I've met him a few times. A quirky fella, but he should be able to help. My thanks.